Hey kids! So we know we all hate having ugly country codes in our dashboard. So here's a quick tip to get all of these country codes converted into country names. What we want to do is, in order to have that data in Data Studio, go to say a list of countries. From there, select the entire table. There are other tricks to do this. But essentially, you can copy the entire table there. Just make sure you have clean columns, copy it, then go over to say a text editor, paste the whole thing. You will notice if you have an advanced text editor, you can, it can be Visual Studio Code or you know whichever. I use TextMate, but uh, uh, to each their own. And then from there, you can select some handy. Uh, replacement feature such as getting all of the columns and only keeping the country code and the country label. From there you can get a regular expression going where you're looking for each of the chunks separated by tabs and then looking for only the country code and the country name. And then from there you can replace all and you have a nice table. Cool. So that's the first step. Now, in uh, Data Studio, I want to be able to create a case condition. So from there, going back to my data source, I can edit my data source and create a new field called country name. From there, just go and create the case condition and go straight to the end condition so where we want to play with is like this so uh, enter when country code equals let's use like a, a basic value then enter the value of my country name right so what we're going to do is we're going to use the same regular expression uh, mechanism in my text editor to replace the values we want here. So just use the mask here. So essentially what we want to do is we want to look for two values, my country code and my country name, and we want to paste my expression in there. So when country code equals the, uh, the country code and then replace it with the country name. And we're adding a tab for good measure so that it's cleaner when you uh, insert it into Data Studio. From there, I'm gonna just clean up my code here. Bam, hit replace all. And that gives me a nice tidy list that I can just copy and paste into Data Studio. From there, I can just save, oh well, yeah, in some cases you'll have to, to create, uh, well, you have to make choices here. I have uh, 250 values. The Data Studio only offers 200, but you get the gist. So assuming I want to only uh, keep the, uh, I want to say the major countries I'm interested in, and the rest can be a, uh, so let's, let's, let's imagine we're going to uh, clean this up and go to say there. From there, the rest becomes else other country. Okay, so th that part is a bit extreme, and you can make your you can pick and choose which countries you have in your uh, in your list. But essentially, once you have that, you can click close, and the good news is you now have a country name field that you can use in your widgets with the added bonus being that I can now use that to power a geograph. So I can add a chart here with a map. And I can use, well, the country code works, but not always. And I can replace this with, with the country name. For a very similar result. And that was it. Enjoy.